hi guys um happy new month to you all and i pray it brings with it everything awesome for us all okay first of all i want to thank every single one of you oh my god i never knew i had this <laughs> this kind of fan base all over the world like people were sending me messages people were oh god i just i love you all i love you guys thank you thank you for the love thank you for all the support i can't believe i'm this loved <laughs> i want to thank you all for that and you know may god bless you and you know i love you guys back okay so mm, i've been wondering do i tell my story or do i not you know there is this saying that uh, there is no smoke without fire and it takes two to tango but you know most times in Nigeria we don't have that kind of patience to, to hear the other parts <laughs> you understand a lot of us here we are so frustrated in this country and you can't blame anybody the country is so hard for all of us even the rich they complain talk more of you know, so it, it, it makes us jump into conclusion without hearing the other party. And, you know, most times it's not really the best thing to do because um, I believe there's a reason where uh, it, when you go to a court for something, you know, the judge will listen to both parties before he or she passes the judgment. This is the reason because if you just kill somebody on just one sided story, you might actually be making a horrible mistake so that's why I'm asking do I tell my story or do I not now a lot of people were telling me no you don't have to you don't owe anybody any explanation just move on with your life while some other people are saying uh, yes we want to hear your side of it we want to hear your story we want to know what you want to say it's okay now my question is if i do tell my story will people listen to understand me or will they just listen to respond because it's two different things it means two different things when you listen to understand it actually helps you to know where that person is coming from it helps you understand why anything was done when you listen to me just to respond I can say that you know I died and I, I came back to life again but it won't mean anything to you because you weren't even listening to hear what you just want why I talk 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 I, you will kill you <laughs> you understand so that's just the problem here will people actually listen to me to understand where I'm coming from hear my side of the story or would they just listen to roast me he gets now we are all human beings and we all have feelings you know nobody ever wakes up and say okay fine i'm going to do this and i'm going to do that i'm going to hurt this person nobody ever does that unless maybe you're a psychopath or something but if you're actually a human being and i pride myself as one in fact not that i'm bragging but i've never met anybody nicer than me and I'm saying this authoritatively. I've never met anybody nicer than I am. I know I'm one kind, generous, happy. I think my second name should actually be happiness because I, I love happiness. I don't joke with it and I don't let anything tamper my happiness, no matter how deep it is. I'm always happy because I believe that I have a God that watches over me i have a god that loves me so much so i'm 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 nice to the core and so because of that I, I think that's actually why i'm feeling like i should tell my story because it really is my life you know i can you can choose to move on with my life i'm happy i'm healthy every member of my family we're all healthy and by god's grace we have our businesses that you know helps us so i'm not really liking anything i'm actually okay and god is good in my life 
so but i think it's that niceness in me you know that is somehow dragging me to want to tell my side of the story even though i know it's not really necessary but i feel like i should say it but the only problem here is will people listen to understand me because if no one is going to listen to understand then what's the point do you get make i just cook my rest now let me just rest just rest my pretty head you get so you know like i ah uh, oh god my tongue is actually not eating anything today oh my this quest to lose weight not be here sorry sorry back to it um i just so um you know so i was just thinking if um i'm just going to hey to god eh if we you back how do i see okay money bujilia money bujilia okay kai perebania ngwa so as i was saying um um the truth is my story is actually quite interesting you know it's it's actually something i believe almost everybody would love to hear and it's quite relatable because i know that um so many people have gone through this i mean i i i, I can't be the first person to have experienced this neither am i gonna be the last this story is something that you know it will melt the heart of anybody you know that has this kind of experience now i want to tell my story i really do you know if not for anything for clarity's sake i want to tell my story i really do because i think it's something that you know people might actually learn one or two things from you know uh, some people might not like it it's normal because everybody will never love you everybody will not hate you but i believe that those ones that you know would love to hear what i have to say i believe you people will learn a lot from it and people will you know it will it will make them wiser although they say experience is the best uh, teacher i believe that but i also believe that my story would um it will change a lot of uh, mindsets you know people would uh, probably understand that nothing is black and blue in this life people think that life is a one-way traffic i mean i used to think that too until life happened to me you know life is never one-way traffic and life is is never um a smooth road you know you get it smooth you get it rough Sometimes you get it raw for a long period of time before you get it smooth, you know. And I believe my story will touch life. In fact, I, 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 I my story is, um, is it's related to that film. Uh, what's the name? Although it's a foreign movie. Hi. Oh my God. Oh, oh, where's one? I can't remember it now, but I might along the way. Then I'll say, and I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell this story. I will, I must actually, I must tell my story because it's important for people to hear. At least those, yeah, excuse me, those ones that loves me, they need to hear that, you know, that their baby girl is still an angel that she is. Because I know I have just love to give. I have nothing else in my heart. I have love to give. I'm the kind of person that gives people benefit of doubt. If you offend me today, I will approach you. Did I do anything wrong? No. So why are you doing this? If you have a tangible reason, I will understand because I know that no one is perfect. If you don't have tangible reason and you're not apologizing, that's when I cut off. So I, I, I pride myself as someone that is worth emulation. Yes, I'm saying it and I'm beating my chest to say it. I'm nice to a fault actually. People use me, I have all my friends, I mean, I have most of my friends, they use me because, you know, 
people are users so i believe that i'm gonna tell this story and people i pray they listen to understand rather than to respond please if um for some reason so you know um if if you think that i should tell my story please indicate you know we have a comment section please say your mind there if you think i shouldn't it's okay still indicate i'll i'll be reading comments you know and if i get more of tell your story then i most definitely will tell my story if i'm getting more of don't then i'll just move on with my life you know and because you know at the end of the day god will judge us all he's the one that sees the heart not human so and i know my heart is pure so i actually don't have anything to worry about but if the comments is telling me to tell my story i promise i will okay so um uh this is where i spy bid you guys Mwah. take care have a wonderful month uh good night or good morning or good afternoon wherever you are i love you guys and i always will Mwah. 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 bye <laughs> so um this is g asen aka equi baby aka equitas <laughs> aka the queen of capricorn <laughs> signing up bye <laughs>